you guys something tonight which I think is like one of the best things you can do with honey. If you ever feel like you're catching a cold, we teach our patients all the time to make something that can knock it out. Has anyone ever used the, I, this uh, lemon honey ginger thing that I've, I've taught them? Has it ever gotten rid of your colds? Yeah. That's right. So if you, I'm going to teach you how to make this. It's really easy. You don't always want to make it when you're sick because you feel tired, but um, if you can catch an illness, if you can catch something right when it's coming in, we call it wind, as wind's coming in, you can pretty much kick it out, okay? So it's equal parts of ginger, lemon, and honey, and then a little bit of turmeric. And you take it straight. So um, if you don't know how to do ginger, I'm going to show you. This is a ginger root. And essentially you take a spoon, not a knife, because you'll lose a lot of the essence of it. And you basically just peel the, uh, the uh, skin. You don't want to lose much of it. This is also a precious substance when you're sick. Okay. And so I have this kind of scraper, which I love. Anyway, so then you, you scrape this. And you wouldn't think ginger would have so much juice in it, but it's very, a lot of juice. Okay. So I even hear back from people, like I've taught people, and I hear other people say, yeah, I've heard that Fawn Smiley makes this thing. And I hear back <laughs> all over town about this. So, But this can really help you not get sick. And then, and basically, I mean, I'm not going to do the whole thing, but basically if you take a hunk about this size, then that's about equal to a lemon, one lemon. So then you're going to, this is lemon. This is my favorite juicer. And this is really potent. Right, Gordon? Right. <laughs> Let's see you that this, right. this is like a shot. Like the first time Gordon ever made it. Think about, I remember him taking it the first time in front of me because he was sick. You want to show him what you did, Gordon? <laughs> what did I do? Ah! <laughs> Ginger juice is really strong. Okay, so then you got those two. You got your honey. I'll put it in here. If anyone wants to taste it, you're brave. But it, I mean, after a while, it's great. Yeah. Okay, so then you take your ginger juice. So was it catching the juice in that? Okay. Yeah. So you can see, see that? And you can use other kind. I mean, I even just juice it in my juicer. But I couldn't bring that. So you got to take this stuff. You can even use like little Parmesan graters. Essentially you put it in your hand. If you've got any cuts on your hands, it's going to hurt. <laughs> and then you take your bowl and just squeeze it. I need it more, but. So you can see. And then lemon. Got your ginger juice. Your lemon juice. And then you're going to take your honey, you know how to do this, and you're going to make equal part of honey. So it's a lot of honey. So if you've got one of those big honey palms, that's the best thing because it's just like chunk, chunk. Okay. And then the best part is you take your turmeric, and it's not equal parts of turmeric. <laughs> you would be hurting. I think you'll have done that. You just go like this with the turmeric. Okay. And then, finger. Take your finger, and you've got to get the honey all stirred in. And you do it until it's stirred, until it's all dissolved. You don't feel good, your kids love to make this for you. That's right. When you don't feel good, she says, your kids love to make this for you. That is true. And then, bombs away. Does anyone want to try it? I'll do it. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. And basically, we always say, 
you gotta down it in one. All right. All of it? Oh, All of it? Oh, yeah. All of it? Okay. Yeah. Let's see your finger. <laughs> that was good. So, good girl. Thanks, Kat. <laughs> so, that's like my favorite recipe in the clinic for people who are getting sick, along, along with like yin chow. But, um, so for one person.